Hi, I'm John Storms, and uh, we're continuing to play with the Falcon Pie Cap. So here we have it all set up for pixels. We hooked it up to two pixel strings, and that worked just amazing. And so today what I want to do is I want to get it hooked up to this guy here. So come around, you can see there's an RJ45 jack up there, and that is not an Ethernet jack. That is for uh, serial output, like um, RS45, so we can hook it up to... RGB dumb controllers, or we can hook it up to a Lightorama box, which is what we're going to try out next. So, I'm going to hook it up to this. This is a 27 channel dumb controller, which means it can control nine RGB elements hanging off of these ports here. Uh, mine is also a 12 volt version, and I have some dumb RGBs hooked up, which are also 12 volt, and I have this hooked up to the same 12 volt power supply as the Pi. Why? Because it's here and it's convenient. Um, I have my 27 channel controller set on channel number one. It's DMX channel one. Of course, these dumb controllers have absolutely no idea what universe they sit on. And all I have to do is on the board here, make sure for DMX, because I'm talking DMX to this. So I have these jumpered for DMX. When I go to Lightarama, then I'll move them all down one to, uh, to Lightarama. So now all I have to do is get a regular old Cat5 cable, which I have here, with RJ45 ends, and I just plug it in. So over here on this guy, you can see this says DMX in. And these connectors are exact, they do exactly the same thing, it's just a different type of connector. Okay, so one end goes there. I find the other end. And, okay, so now I have this blue wire connecting from my Pi cap to my 27 channel dumb controller. And it's going to control these lights along with this guy. So I'll power it up and I give a quick flash. Of course, I got the console still hooked up. So this is the, uh, the Pi booting up there. Booting Linux up. So it's booting up. I can see that this guy has power. That's good. And the Pi. Little lights are flashing on the Pi. I have lights on the Pi cap. Just to double check, those jumpers are set up for DMX. And that's important because DMX and Lightarama use different pins. Okay, so now we're on the computer, and I'm using the web browser to connect to my uh, Falcon player, or to the um, the Pi, the Raspberry Pi that has the Pi cap on it. And my, the IP address for that is 10.0.0.213. Here I'm on the uh, main page, and I can see that the uh, FPP daemon is running. So what I want to do is I want to go configure this so that I can control those outputs. Um, that is the 27 channels on the DOM RGB controller. So I go up here to Input Output Setup tab, then underneath that select Channel Outputs. I select the other tab, and of course here I already have my configuration for my pixel strings that we did on the previous video. So now I'm going to say Add, and I'm going to add DMX Open. Okay, and basically I'm going to say uh, on that particular port, that little RJ45 jack port. I'm going to have all 512. Now I could just say 27 for that particular controller or I could even say well I have four ports in use 1, 2, 3, 4 times 3 which would be 12 so I could say 12 channels but just to be easy I'm going to leave it at 512. Then under port I select this guy it is the only guy there. Okay and I click here so that it's uh, enabled or active I hit save. It wants to restart the FPP daemon. I say restart FPPD. Okay. Now I go to status and control tab. Go down and select display testing from that. And this takes me to the test page. So here I just say how many channels. Let me see. I had 48 pixels on one string and then another 25 pixels on the other. 
and then I have nine channels on the other box so that's a total of 82 RGB channels times three gives me 246 channels 246 and you don't have to be exact and then I come up here uh, I select chase then I come up here and select enable taste test mode and it is doing stuff let's see chase isn't my favorite let's do RGB and it is cycling through the RGB okay so here we are this is the uh, the test pattern being run so it's doing an RGB chase so it's going red green blue red green blue cycling through and of course it's doing it for the pixels uh, but it's also doing it for the dumb RGBs that I have hanging off of my uh, 27 port controller so just a quick recap I have everything being powered from this one uh, 12 volt power supply I have the Falcon Pi, not the Falcon Pi, the Raspberry Pi uh, mini computer, and it actually is on its own power supply here. Um, the GPI, the uh, Falcon Pi cap board. I have the jumpers set to DMX, and then for the power jumper, I have the power jumper set. I have all three of them jumpered, specifying seven to twenty-four volts. And then I have my pixel lights connected to these two interfaces here, and then on the RJ45, with it set, the jumper set to DMX, I have a regular Cat5 cable uh, going over to here on this board, which is set to DMX channel 1, and these four ports are populated, and they are cycling. It's very pretty.